What's up, Loopsters? I hope you're doing well. And this week, we celebrate Easter. And because it was Easter, we had some gross eggs. Two, one. <laughs> there he is. Oh, no. This is sweet as fish. That means he got fish. I'm not making these connections very fast. I got two of the fish. <laughs> Sorry. I spit it on the floor. Here you go. Oh, um, these Swedish fish are really sticking to my teeth. How awful. Oh yeah, how awful, JB. <laughs> I was amazed by how many gummy versions of food they had out there, and I was very grateful that I got a lot of them <laughs> instead of the real counterpart. Like, I love it. A hot dog, a gummy hot dog with all all the uh, friction, all the fixes. How adorable. <laughs> <laughs> we also took a look at Romans 6, 23, and it says, For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. So Jesus, like, if you can imagine Jesus during his time, a lot of people would probably think that he would be treated like royalty or like a famous celebrity. And you would only think that only the people who are cool and on the in with Jesus could be close with Jesus. But no, Jesus' disciples were people that were not super religious scholars or people who were even, like, really popular. Like, they were, like, fishermen and just regular people. He served people. He washed his disciples' feet. He, like, lived life with people. And he showed them what God's love looked like in action. And going back to the Bible verse... The gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord is available to everyone. There's no exclusivity to eternal life with God. And Jesus didn't keep any of his teachings just to himself or just to people who were like of the most influence or the coolest people in town. But he would have regular sermons and he would go to where people were and he would share it with everyone. And that wasn't normal. And I'm grateful for it because, you know, that means that we don't have to be perfect to have eternal life with him. Uh, we can come as we are. And I just think that it's an incredible gift. And I love that. And since we are talking about gifts, what is a really great gift that you have gotten or given? Um, you know, understandably, it's not going to be eternal life, but whatever else is uh, a gift that you think is a really good gift to give or want to get, uh, let us know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, enjoy the ride!